My name is Ed Church. I'm the plant manager for Hoka Materials. Uh, we are a greenfield company, and one of the things we looked at if we're in, in many different places was the power, where the power comes from, because we are greenfield. We're going to make polysilicon here in Idaho. We looked at many different states and different countries trying to find a, a, a good fit for where we would uh, be able to build our facility because we're going to use a lot of uh, power for uh, our facility. So um, with Idaho having both uh, hydro and geothermal energy, it was a perfect fit. Along with that, we also have Idaho Power, who has been great to work with over the, the last two years now in making sure that we had the power on site to, to, to build our facility. You can go to a different state, say Kentucky, where they get their power from coal. Well, we're greenfield, so that really doesn't make sense to get your something that you're trying to do for the future for solar, and then, you, and then you're using coal. So really, it comes down to using Idaho's power, which makes sense to us. There's a highly skill set here, both diversified and skill set for what you need for a polysilicon plant. You need chemical engineers. You have great companies such as Micron, On Semiconductor, uh, Simplot, and the Idaho National Labs is not far from here. Here in Pocatello, you have Idaho State University, and they've been real helpful in recruiting, hiring, and giving us facilities to train people that they're really here to help us. So it's been very good, and with the, all the applicants I have in hand, they're all able, willing, and, and ready to go to work. Pocatello is the, the gateway to the Northwest. You have the highways, you have the air, you have rail, and you have the maritime not far from here. You have the, one of the largest airports in Pocatello where you can land your large airplanes. You can get your products out and products in and, and equipment. Sometimes you have to have large equipment and you can, they can bring them in on the plane. All of our customers are, are overseas in China, and so we'll be able to export that product over to them, and they'll make the solar cells, which will go out throughout the United States, overseas, and use in those areas. Pocatello City uh, has been very helpful from the mayor on down to his engineers, helps us to get our permitting and let us start permitting within, by the time we got our permit, two weeks you could start building. You don't get that very often in, in other states. And also the land cost is reasonable. There, that, that really helps when you're, when you're dealing with, we're, we're sitting on 67 acres. Idaho is one of the top five states to do business in. That was just put in, uh, in not too long ago in, in all the newspapers and Forbes and things like that. One of the things that my boss, Carl Taft, came up with is that we have a lot of excess of heat from the water that cool down our reactors. And one of the things we, he came up with was the share of the water. So he contacted Great Western Malting and they heat their process up with natural gas. Well, we can send our water over there heat up their process so it's a win-win situation. It's an income for us, it saves the environment, and it helps them with their process as well. Idaho is a great place to live. People want to live in Idaho. I mean, you've got great hunting, fishing, skiing, golfing, water sports right outside your front door. So if you bring in a business into Idaho, it's a win-win situation for the company and for the employees because everybody wants to stay here. You are where you play. And we have hundreds of thousands of acres to do just that.